Well, hello and welcome to our Mississippi Marketplace preview special right here on 12 News, brought to you this year by Patty Peck Honda. I'm Byron Brown. Thousands of people come to Jackson each year for this one of a kind shopping event. It's a Mississippi holiday tradition presented by the Junior League of Jackson. And for the next 30 minutes, we'll be bringing the marketplace to you at home. So this is Melanie Christopher and Walt Grayson joining us now live from inside the Mississippi Trademark. And what can you all tell us what we're going to see this year about the theme, Melanie and Walt? All right. Good evening, everyone. We are delighted, Walt and I, to be with you for the Mistletoe Marketplace preview. Now, this is a ticketed only event, Walt. Yes. But here's your chance to get a, a, a pretty good idea of what's down here anyway. We're going to be talking to some of the people who are in charge of putting this on and also there are also people who are the higher ups in the uh, uh, junior league. Oh, yes. So they'll be telling us where some of these funds go too, because this is not just for Christmas. This is for the city of Jackson and, and it's for projects that go year round. Uh, and they do so much. The junior league it has their hand in so many projects and this is their biggest fundraiser of the year. And this is considered among the junior league events across the country, a premier mistletoe marketplace. And I think the population of Jackson about doubles for this three day period so. right here of all the people who are coming into town. This is a big deal but you got a chance to come down and see it yesterday i'll tell you that's right I, I, I call it the the mistletoe eve take a look a day or two ago i thought i'd take a ride down jackson's high street the trademark in my sight once i got inside all i could say was oh my Filled to the top with goods. Oh, what fun it is to ride a Ferris wheel that caught my eye. Now the trademark's full. Go it while you're young. Take the girls along. Oh, what fun it is at Mistletoe 2021. We call it Mistletoe Eve the night before the big event, when all the shopkeepers and their elves are busy stocking the shelves. They're unboxing the goods, getting those decorations just right. If you're new to the scene, you might ask why. Why not? It's time for Christmas sales. I love it. I love Christmas. It's my favorite time of the year. The stockings hung by the tree, in perfect alignment we can see, stacking those shelves so pretty and bright but behind some of these pieces of joy is a mission to make the world better and bright. We hire women coming out of prison, we hire individuals with disabilities, and we hire a population of people who have grown up in chronic poverty that may not have an opportunity for, for work and employment. Now, if Christmas is your favorite time of the year, We've got something you must hear. So our shop is an over-the-top holiday shop for those over-the-top holiday people. So we're really excited just to share our style and ideas for the Christmas holidays with all the shoppers that are going to be here with us at Mistletoe. Something for everyone. Something for all. It's Mistletoe, y'all. I will right, we'll check back with Walt and Melly in just a moment, but now let's head on over to the red carpet. And that is where we find 12 News. It's Kayla Thompson. She joins us live. And what's it look like out there, Kayla? Yeah, so I'm here with Bethany Morrow Johnson right now, and you are the chair of the event. So what is it like putting on something like this? Uh, it is a huge undertaking. This is the 41st year of Mistletoe Market, and Mistletoe is the Junior League's largest fundraiser. So talk to me about putting on something like this. I mean, what goes into it? Y'all have a lot of people behind the scenes. Yes, so it's a year and a half in the making from year to year. There are 16 people total on the committee, everything from stage, 
to decorations to corporate sponsors. We cover it all. Nice. So then when we think about, oh, what fun, right. what kind of fun are you going to provide for us this year? So the theme this year is, oh, what fun. And oh, what fun it is to volunteer. Oh, what fun it is to serve in your community and be a part of the Junior League of Jackson. And the, we this year went all out with lots of color and fun and whimsical. Awesome. So that's something we definitely look forward to seeing. I'm going to send it back to you guys inside for more of what's happening in this awesome show. Thank, Thank you so much. All right, thank you, Kayla. Now let's send things back over to Melanie, who's inside the trademark, with more on what the fun things you can look for inside the trademark. Melanie? Thank you. Thank, thank you very much. Bethany, join me right now. This is Bethany Cooley. Hello. These decorations are fabulous. Thank tell, you. Tell me all the, that went into this. All the things. So this year we really wanted shoppers to feel the magic and joy of the holiday season. Creating this was so much fun. As you can see behind us, we have a 22-foot Ferris wheel. I, I'm yeah. still, I still have to look at it. Yes. I cannot believe that. And then in the sept tent, we have over 200,000 lights in the it's ceiling. It's beautiful. And then we have storefronts. So shoppers, when you walk in, we really want you to feel like you're in a city. So yeah. Oh, it's it fun. is just absolutely beautiful. And all of you wearing your coordinating dresses and all, it is just simply beautiful here. A lot of work goes into this. Tell me how the folks at home that come can take some of these decorations home. You absolutely can take them home. Go to www.mistletoedecorations.square.site. And you can and, and have a chance of, of getting these yeah. when you break down yeah. at yes, the end. Yes, after breakdown, yes, everything is for sale. Well, I know that it's a year out that you planned this we event. Do. So already the next one, they already yes. know the yes. theme. We and have, yeah, we have a wonderful committee coming in. As soon as this is over, they come in, they start taking down, and they plan for 2022. Tell people why they should come. You should come to Mistletoe because it's amazing. It's magical. And for me, I love Mistletoe. It kicks off the holiday season. Everyone here is so happy. They're so happy to be out and about. Christmas music's going and the snow will be falling over the Ferris wheel. <laughs> and with those adorable creatures on the uh, the Ferris wheel too. All right, well that'll do it for us right now at Mistletoe. We will be back in just a few minutes. All right, thank you, Melina. Now let's check back in with Kayla, who's uh, on the red carpet right now. Kayla? <laughs> Yeah, right now I'm here with Katie Browning, and you are the president of the Junior League of Jackson. How are these funds that are raised going to be used for the marketplace? Well, that is a great question. All of the revenue that we generate from the Mistletoe Marketplace actually goes to fund the mission of the Junior League, which is focused on community projects, improving the community through effective action, through volunteerism, but also through, um, we also look at developing the potential of women. We supply lots of training, education, educational opportunities for our members. So what are some examples of the ways that you guys are supporting the community? I mean, with children and all of that. So we have over 30 projects uh, and initiatives throughout the Jackson Metro area, and those focus on early literacy, children's health, and social development. And what we're really trying to do is improve the graduation rate here in Jackson. And so that could look like anything from summer camps, or which are one of my favorites. Um, and then, you know, even after school programs, um, we have uh, a lot of interest in um, eliminating childhood hunger. We supply over 3,000 meals uh, every year to um, different organizations, to children. And then we just recently gave a check for $97,000 to JPS for teacher grants. Wow. So then when you think about supporting the community, I mean, is this something that you guys are definitely going to continue to do for uh, years and years to come? Yes, we plan on it. This is the 41st Mistletoe. I know Bethany just told you that. Our organization, the Junior League, is actually 81 years old and so we plan to be here a lot longer we want to continue the good work we've got women who are ready to serve and we want to make sure that we continue our partnerships um, we look at our, our community partners truly as as making relationships with them and we want to make sure that we're working together to truly make change uh, that is long-lasting so amazing well thank you so much for that and we have more of our preview show coming up sponsored by Patty Pack Honda <laughs> 